good morning everyone. Happy Monday. Uh, parking garage, I'm going to Barnes & Noble, do some homework for a little bit. And stay in the area because the uh, gaming thing I want to go to tonight is like five minutes away from the Barnes & Noble, so that's a plus. And uh, yeah, so far it's a good day, got some good sleep. Uh, it's the start of a busy week because I have doctor's appointments on Wednesday and Friday and uh, this morning was jam-packed with all kinds of phone calls so that's why I'm just now picking up the phone. Or the camera. That sounds fun. So before I get stuck in an elevator, I'm going to go into Barnes & Noble and do some homework. So just finishing up at Barnes & Noble and uh, had lunch at Elevation Burger. <clears throat> Good food. Good food. Uh, since my brain is thoroughly fried, I'm going to be relaxing the rest of the evening and then uh, going to a game thing at 6 p.m. Thought it was five, it's actually six, so it gives me a little bit more time to uh, do stupid things, like go to the mall or something. Who knows? But I'm walking back toward my truck now, and then uh, the next thing on the schedule is the six o'clock meetup, so such is life. Just got done walking around the mall and uh, picked up some more nerd t-shirts similar to this. One is uh, the star shirt for our, uh, the police officers for Raccoon City and then I got a couple Star Wars shirts so oh yeah good haul at the mall uh, under $30 for all of them they're on clearance so that's a plus and then I come to find out that one of my favorite nerd stores online Think Geek is actually owned by GameStop so they say so yeah there's a couple of other things I want to get from there and then awesome con is at the end of March so I'm planning on going there and I'm just trying to coordinate with some friends see if they can come along as well and uh, it's a big nerd convention it's Comic Con for DC basically it's not basically it is Comic Con for DC it's just called awesome con instead of Comic Con since that's copyrighted and only San Diego is the place for it real comic-con so they say uh, still got about another hour and a half before the meetup tonight at Husa so I'm probably just gonna drive around in circles for five minutes and do something I'm not sure but such is life so far this evening has been a great evening of fun and gaming uh, we close the shop down which is awesome and then everybody from this group goes to IHOP after and they do this pretty much every Monday so it's freaking awesome. Uh, definitely nerded out, we played a couple of great games. Uh, I really like the group that I'm with right now so this is awesome. And uh, yeah, so now I'm headed to IHOP to get some dinner slash breakfast. It's 10, 10 at night and we're going to IHOP. So onward. Just finishing up at the IHOP. Uh, awesome time, great group of people, good times. Looking forward to uh, coming back to the one next week. Uh, they do this every Monday, so it's gonna be fun. Uh, now that I'm done at the IHOP, I am going to hit the highway home. It's already midnight, so it's been a very long day to say the least. So homeward bound, it is. It has been a really fun day. Uh, Productive with homework, productive with meeting new people, and doing some interesting games, and just immersing myself into life. It's fun. Uh, yeah, it was awesome. It's already like 12.30 at night. I am ridiculously tired. Uh, still rocking a leather bag, but I'm really, I know, I've got this argument like the past 12 times and everyone's going to say, you're going to go back to leather bag anyway. I know, I know. But I'm probably hurting myself more using a leather bag than if I switch to a book bag, so I think it's time I switch to a book bag for now. Uh, only because I'm putting too much pressure on one side versus the other and that can hurt my lungs a little bit more than I'm used to. That and I had a doctor tell me I should not be using a shoulder bag, just saying. But with that in mind, it is what it is. Now tomorrow I'm looking to hang out with my friend Colette and possibly Darren at Fort Belvoir. 
I'll be texting them tomorrow to find out what their schedules are like. So maybe we can go see Black Panther or walk around a mall or do something along those lines. Um, but yeah, and today I had to reset the sensor for my Dexcom. So I've got an extra seven days out of this patch. I can't believe it's been seven days already since I went snowboarding. It's amazing how fast time flies. Such is life. But without further ado, I'm going to end the vlog here tonight by saying as always, have a great night and I will see you guys tomorrow.